Hey guys, Courtney Despis, Director of Education with Trout's Fly Fishing. In today's installment of Trout's Tips, we're going to work on the loop-to-loop -loop knot in order to connect your fly line to your leader. Now that you have your rod and reel lined up, it's time to connect our leader onto our line. In order to do this, we want to use a loop-to-loop -loop knot. What we're looking to do is we're looking to create a connection point between the loop in your line and the loop in your leader. In order to do this, we're going to go two ways. The first way is that we're going to put our line loop through our leader loop. Once you have your line loop through your leader loop, you're going to double your leader over and you're gonna move that doubled part of your leader back through your line loop. As you bring it through the loop, you're gonna pull until your terminal end of your leader comes all the way through. What you'll see now is that you have an overlapped portion between your line and your leader. Your goal now is to seat the two. As you seat the two and pull, you're gonna notice that you have four connection points, two on each side, of this loop-to-loop -loop connection. Those four connection points are key in knowing that you did this connection point correctly to create the most strength of the connection. Thanks for joining us for this installment of Trout's Tips. For additional parts of this series, visit our Trout's YouTube channel and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.